Welcome to the Space Sage. In this journey through the solar system, we will explore the planets, moons, asteroids, and other objects that make up our celestial neighborhood. The solar system, the planetary system that contains our sun and its surrounding planets, is a vast and complex system that has fascinated humanity for centuries. From the innermost planet Mercury to the outer reaches of the Kuiper Belt, the solar system is full of wonders and mysteries waiting to be explored. In our exploration of the solar system, we will examine the challenges and opportunities of space exploration, the importance of space science, and the ethical implications of our actions. The Sun, a nearly perfect sphere of hot plasma, is the central star of the solar system. It is by far the largest object in the solar system, with a diameter of 1.4 million kilometers. The Sun is the source of energy for all life on Earth and is responsible for the Earth's climate and weather patterns. It is also the driving force behind space weather, which can impact our technological infrastructure, satellites, and power grids. The eight planets of the solar system are divided into two groups, the inner planets, Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars, and the outer planets, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. The inner planets are relatively small and rocky, while the outer planets are larger and made mostly of gas and ice. Each planet has its own unique characteristics and features, from the massive storms on Jupiter to the thin atmosphere of Mars. Mercury, the smallest planet in the solar system, is also the closest planet to the Sun. Its surface is covered in craters and is hot enough to melt lead during the day and cold enough to freeze nitrogen at night. Venus, the second planet from the Sun, is similar in size and composition to Earth. However, its thick atmosphere traps heat and causes surface temperatures to exceed 460 degrees Celsius, making it the hottest planet in the solar system. Earth, the third planet from the Sun, is the only known planet in the universe with liquid water and the conditions necessary to support life. Its atmosphere protects it from harmful radiation and provides the oxygen necessary for life. Mars, the fourth planet from the Sun, is known as the red planet due to its reddish appearance. It has a thin atmosphere and is home to the largest volcano in the solar system, Olympus Mons. Jupiter, the largest planet in the solar system, is a gas giant with a thick atmosphere and many moons. Its great red spot is a massive storm that has been raging for over 300 years. Saturn, known for its distinctive rings, is the second largest planet in the solar system. Its rings are made up of ice particles and rock fragments and are thought to have formed from the debris of a destroyed moon. Uranus, the third largest planet in the solar system, is an ice giant with a tilted axis of rotation. Its rings are much less prominent than those of Saturn and are thought to be made up of small particles and dust. Neptune, the outermost planet in the solar system, is also an ice giant with a deep blue color. It has the strongest winds in the solar system, with gusts reaching up to 2,400 km per hour. In addition to the planets, the solar system is home to hundreds of moons, ranging in size from small asteroid-like bodies to large objects with complex geology and internal structures. The Moon, Earth's only natural satellite, is the fifth largest moon in the solar system. Its surface is covered in craters, mountains, and valleys, and its gravitational influence causes tides on Earth. Jupiter has the most moons of any planet in the solar system, with at least 79 confirmed satellites. Its four largest moons, known as the Galilean moons, Io, Europa, Ganymede, and Callisto, are some of the most fascinating objects in the solar system. Io is the most volcanically active object in the solar system, while Europa is believed to have a subsurface ocean that could potentially harbor life. Saturn has at least 82 known moons, with its largest moon, Titan, being the second largest moon in the solar system. Titan's thick atmosphere is composed mostly of nitrogen, with trace amounts of methane and other gases, and its surface is home to lakes and seas of liquid hydrocarbons. Uranus has at least 27 known moons, with its largest moon, Miranda, exhibiting a bizarre and chaotic surface with large canyons and ridges. Neptune has at least 14 known moons, with its largest moon, Triton, being the seventh largest moon in the solar system. Triton is unique in that it is the only large moon in the solar system that orbits in the opposite direction of its planet's rotation. In addition to the eight planets and their moons, the solar system is home to several dwarf planets, which are smaller than traditional planets but still large enough to be round and have gravitational pull. The most famous of these dwarf planets is Pluto, 
which was once considered the ninth planet in the solar system but was later reclassified as a dwarf planet. Pluto is located in the Kuiper Belt, a region beyond Neptune that is home to many other small icy objects. Other notable dwarf planets include Ceres, the largest object in the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter, and Eris, which is larger than Pluto and also located in the Kuiper Belt. The solar system is also home to a vast number of smaller objects, such as asteroids and comets, that orbit the Sun. Asteroids are rocky and metallic objects that are mostly located in the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter. Some asteroids are large enough to be considered dwarf planets, while others are small enough to be classified as meteoroids. Comets are icy objects that originate from the outer reaches of the solar system and have highly elliptical orbits that bring them close to the Sun. When a comet gets close to the Sun, the heat causes its ice to vaporize, creating a visible coma and a long tail. Exploring the solar system is not without its challenges, both scientific and technical. The vast distances between objects in the solar system make space travel difficult and expensive, and the harsh conditions of space pose risks to both humans and equipment. However, space exploration also offers opportunities for scientific discovery, technological innovation, and even economic benefits. Studying the solar system can help us better understand our place in the universe and the origins of life, while technological advancements in space travel can have practical applications on Earth, such as improved transportation and communication systems. Space science plays a vital role in our understanding of the solar system and the universe as a whole. From studying the planets and moons to observing distant galaxies, space science has the potential to unlock some of the biggest mysteries of the universe. In addition to pure scientific research, space science has practical applications in fields such as medicine, telecommunications, and environmental monitoring. Space-based technologies, such as GPS and weather satellites, have revolutionized our daily lives and improved our ability to predict and respond to natural disasters. As we continue to explore the solar system and develop new technologies for space travel and research, we must consider the ethical implications of our actions. For example, as we search for signs of life on other planets or moons, we must consider how our actions may affect any potential life forms we encounter. We also must consider the potential environmental impact of space exploration and ensure that we are not causing harm to the solar system in our pursuit of knowledge. Furthermore, space exploration can be a costly endeavor, and we must consider the allocation of resources and the distribution of benefits. While space exploration offers many potential benefits, we must ensure that the costs are not disproportionately borne by certain groups, and that the benefits are shared among all people. The solar system is a vast and complex place, full of mysteries and wonders that continue to capture our imagination. From the planets and moons to the asteroids and comets, each object in the solar system has a unique story to tell, and studying them can help us better understand the origins and evolution of our solar system and the universe as a whole. As we continue to explore the solar system and develop new technologies for space travel and research, we must do so with a sense of responsibility and awareness of the ethical implications of our actions. By doing so, we can ensure that the benefits of space exploration are shared among all people and that we are making informed and responsible decisions about the future of our solar system and our place in the universe. To stay updated on the latest developments in space exploration and to support our efforts to learn more about our place in the universe, please consider liking and subscribing to our channel. By doing so, you will be joining a community of people who share our passion for space exploration and who are committed to making informed and responsible decisions about the future of our solar system. Thank you for your support.